Hello my patron peeps, it's Allie and I had a request from a patron on what I take with me when I go out of town. I am going out of town for two weeks and I thought this would be a fun uh, exclusive video for y'all. Some of y'all, like me, may go out of town and um, you know, want to take some journaling stuff with you. And so you might be curious, well, what does Allie take with her? So I just wanted to share that with you today. Something that I'm not going to grab and pull over here that I do take with me on longer extended trips is my selfie Canon printer. It is the older CP910, I think. Um, Y'all have seen it. I mean, I might could pull it. I just don't want it to unplug and do the whole let's waste a picture film thing. Okay, I am pulling it. <laughs> So this is what I take with me. It packs up really nicely in my suitcase. And I just use some clothes and kind of put like wrap it around there so that it doesn't like jostle too much in my bag. But I mean, this thing comes, this thing comes out. I mean, it's very compact. I mean, you can pack that no problem in your bag. So that absolutely comes with me when I go on a long uh, extended stay out of town. Um, and I bought this printer actually on my last year's, I say vacation, it, it is a vacation, but we're visiting the parentals, um, Dave's family and my family in Florida. So we're going to Georgia for a week and we'll be in Florida for a week. And um, I'm actually meeting up with Rita, Rita Weaver, I can't wait. I hope, I really hope that works out because I really wanna meet you in real life. So this I bought last year on my trip down there um, because I didn't wanna mess with like you know, going to the store, making someone go with me to Walgreens or whatever. So I just bought the printer and it has been wonderful. It has been acting a little bit goofy, telling me that like this paper isn't the right, oop, not that. <laughs> this paper isn't the right paper to use, but I'm like, you don't know me. My selfie printer is, I take that with me for sure. The other thing that I'm taking with me, and you might be surprised, but I'm not taking any distress stains, I don't think this time. I need to do an updated video on my distress stains because some of them, I'm telling you, they stink and they've changed color. And like, let's see if I can find one. Like this one is scattered straw and it it's kind of like, let me do it on the back so it's not like, it looks kind of green and it smells funky. It smells kind of funky. I don't know. It doesn't look like the scattered straw that I bought. You know what I mean? I don't know what's happening. Someone said they're probably oxidizing. You can even tell in the bottle that it looks greener, which is bizarre. So if I do, when I repurchase, I will probably repurchase certain colors. I mean, if I had to do it all, 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 all over again, then I'd probably only purchase a few colors so I could use them up, and then I would use stick with my watercolors. And also, this takes up less space. This is my Daniel Smith watercolor palette, and that takes up way less space than, you know, I have my random crap bag, which absolutely comes with me, and look, boom. There's my watercolors in there. Um, random crap bag for sure. I'll probably stuff in some journaling cards in here and some like clear embellishment stuff in here. Obviously gonna be taking a few like of each color of washi, like a, a red, a green, and I'm just gonna have to be okay with that, like my limited amounts of washi. But I'll probably take about, I don't know, five rolls of washi and put some journaling cards, so a little bit of clear elements in here. Definitely my Daniel Smith watercolors. I will absolutely be taking my dynamo. I know it's called a dymo, but I like it calling a dynamo. I don't know why. I wish I need to like make my own brand and call it a dynamo. <laughs> but anyway, I'm gonna be taking this with me. Um, unfortunately, my little cutting, cutting function on here does not work, so I've been wasting a lot of the black tape, but that I love and I will take with me. Also, my tiny attacher. I have got to take this with me because I use this for everything. I just love that. So these two are a little bit, this one's a little bulky, but I'm gonna take it. This one's not so bulky, but I'm taking it. Um, okay, so I've got those, my Daniel Smith I'm taking, 
Uh, what else am I taking? I was super, super, super tempted to take Ecoline, but I would feel so bad if there's like a huge mess in my bag from that. But I was going to take one of my water, or not water, yeah, watercolor brushes, my finer ones, so that if I wanted to do some hand lettering with the Daniel Smith, I can do that on the page if I just have my brush. I also think that it'd be cool to take, um, like this is an aqua brush filled with Ecoline. I think I'm gonna fill up a couple more of these that I have with the Ecoline watercolor so that it's already ready to go and it's in a brush. So I might take maybe three of these, not sure. Definitely like a few, like three brushes. I'll probably take my number 12, uh, probably my number four cheapo brush and then probably like a hand lettering brush. So that'll be all the brushes that I take. Um, and then for sure stamp pad, just probably just standard black stamp pad. For sure my stencil. And <clears throat> definitely want to take uh, a date stamp. I need to get another one of these like office date stamps because these ones are so old that I think I it's not doesn't have 2016 on it but either that one or an updated uh, date stamp I want to take because I love that <coughs> and then I'm thinking I'm definitely taking for sure my noodlers ink and I'm gonna have to put this in a baggie or something but this I know I run out of ink all the time and because I'm writing so much with this pen. Oh, sad story, y'all. I uh, totally lost my coral, my, my limited edition neon coral pen, my Lamy Safari. I'm so bummed about that. I went to a, that worship conference, and when I was sick, I, mean, I was so foggy brained. It, it fell out of my Chic Sparrow Lovey, and it, it was not returned. So that's a bummer, bummer, bummer. But yes, taking my Noodler's ink, because I always refill with that. And let's see, I think, let's see, I've got washi tape, got my pictures, I got some journaling cards, got some hand lettering, got my stencils. Oh, my pens, for sure. I'm totally taking my Jelly Roll pens. And you know what? I'm probably going to add some of the newer paint pens that I've been getting to, to take those too. So I love using these paint pens as well. So probably take those. And yeah, I think I think that will probably be good. I'm tempted to take some shimmer mist but I think I'll be all right without them. But that's kind of like a good, you know, it's not too much, I don't think. Um, my thing, this, I think that's about it, and some washi. I should take a picture. What I'll try to do is when I pack, I'll take a, a floor picture or maybe a table picture of everything that I actually really do bring and I'll post it on the patron feed for you. So you can kind of see how much space or whatever it is. Um, and maybe I can put something for to scale for size or you know, what is it, size for scale? I don't know how to say that. That is what I'm gonna take. Now when I go on a shorter trip, I don't go this elaborate. I probably will already have a couple pages prepped, honestly, with the watercolor. And then I'll usually take like my zip pocket printer. I don't take the selfie. And I take my noodler's pen, my noodler's ink, and uh, my pen, of course. I might take my, my pens and a couple things of washi, but I really don't take a ton with me if it's a short, like two day trip or something. But when it's like a two week trip, no, I need to have more supplies at my greedy little fingertips because I just, I just love playing. I love playing and all that fun stuff. I love to create, Matt. <laughs> there you go, that's what I am taking. Be looking out for that picture because I do have to pack here in a couple days and uh, yeah, I should probably, be doing that. When am I packing? I think I'm packing Tuesday. But yeah, so I will try to take that picture. I will take that picture and I'll post it. But if y'all have any other questions or 
any tips for me? I would love to hear your tips too. Like what do you do when you are going on a trip? Tell me, I'd love to hear. Thanks so much for watching and thanks for so, so much for your support. And I will see y'all when I get back. Oh, and I'm, I'm checking on Periscope because I'm checking in there. I'm gonna do some Periscope uh, feeds or feed, what, right? like live, I don't know. I'm gonna be on Periscope when I'm out of town. So hopefully I'll see you there. I'll talk to y'all later. I appreciate y'all so, so much. Thank you, bye.